John McNicholas. Thanks for checking out today's video. In this video, I'm going to show you two ways to play the new Mitski song. If you liked the video, please like and subscribe down below. Leave me a comment. Maybe there's another song or artist you'd like to see me cover. And then check out the Patreon where you can download the PDF for this lesson as well as both versions of the guitar profile for this lesson. And then there's a ton of other content up on the website. Grab a guitar, grab a capo if you want to, and let's play. If we're going by how the record sounds, I think this song is going to be in drop D tuning, although there's a couple of ways we can play it. We're going to start with drop D. In order to get this song to sound like the record, we're going to need to be in drop D tuning. So we're going to take our low E string up here and drop it two notes from E to D. Now, a majority of this song just has four chords that'll go around and around and around. There's only one exception in the bridge, and the strumming pattern is going to be down, down, up, up, down, 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 up. And it's going to go like that the whole song. So we're going to take these little power chords. Because we're in drop D, we can use one finger now to play a power chord. And we're going to start on 11. And then go to 6. Up to 13. Back down to 8. And if you're like me, you're playing an acoustic guitar that meets at the 14th fret. I'm going to use my third finger the whole time, so when I go up to the 13th fret, I'm not sort of having to twist my hand a little bit to get in there. So the majority of the song is just going to be from 11 to 6 to 13 to 8. And the only exception we're going to see is in the bridge part of the song. We're going to have a four chord repeating pattern going into that bridge, but it's going to sound like it starts on the second chord of that progression. So when you're listening to it, the singing is going to come in on this chord, the sixth fret. It's going to go up to 13, back down to 8, and then this first chord here on the 11th fret. It's going to sound like the first chord uh, of the main pattern, but it's really going to be the first chord of the bridge, and it's going to play one measure, and then it's going to go down to the third fret. It's going to do that two times, and then it's going to go back up to the 13th fret, or I'm sorry, the 11th fret, and then it's going to stay there as it goes into the next section, starting the whole pattern over again. So let me run through that all together so you can get a better idea. All right, so here we are from the start of the second verse. She's not going to sing over this first bar, but instead is going to start singing when I get down to the sixth fret. But it's going to go like this, and I'm just going to play it one time through, so one of the four chord repetitions into the bridge. So we start with uh, 11. She starts singing right here. And here comes the bridge. Back down to 3. Back to 11. Next section. So it's an interesting little twist. You play it along, I'm sure you'll get it pretty quick. Let's take a look at a different way to play the song in a different tuning. To get the guitar back in standard tuning, we're just going to raise the low E string from D to E. And for this version of the song, we're going to play the same chords, but we're going to play them in a first position standard chord shape. So we're going to use a capo on the first fret. And then you want to check your tuning. Sounds good. All right, so the chord progression, if you're going to play it with the capo on the first fret, is going to go from C to G to D to A. And that's just going to repeat down, down, up, up, down, up, down. When it gets into that other section in the bridge, where well, it's going to start on the C, so this will be the first chord of the bridge. Now to E. Back to C for two measures. New section. C, G, D, A. And that's how to play the song. 
Well, thanks for watching. If you liked the video, please like and subscribe down below. Leave me a comment. Maybe there's another song or artist, or maybe another Mitski song you'd like to see me cover. And then check out the Patreon. For as little as five bucks a month, you're going to get a PDF and a guitar profile of both versions of this song, as well as hundreds of others. Thanks. I'll see you next time.